Hello there, everyone. It's been quite a while, hasn't it? I mean, it's been a long, long time. But besides that, hello there, everyone. My name is Casey, aka Ethan. One thing today. Where was I? The quick answer to that was really, in the last year, I've been having a really fun time. I created the KCS Tech franchise and a whole lot more, the biggest one being the KCS Tech. KCS Tech ended up making the most views and being something I enjoyed creating. However, a big problem I had during this era was having motivation to continue creating content, which was really hard for me to pull together. I mean, during that time, I was going through really, really exciting times. For example, building a computer right back there. And that was fun. I got really, really excited and I built it. And then after that, I just had a big plunge. I dropped. Same thing with this microphone. Same thing with the GoXLR. Same thing with multiple things. This kept happening. I kept losing it. That was down to my mania or depression. I did get something for my depression. I got antidepressants, Zoloft, and I've been taking that for roughly a year now, and that has been working fantastic for me. I still have problems with that. And I do have mania, like I said. Mania is causing me to have these ups and downs, highs and lows, and just constantly like a, like a wiggle almost, like a line that constantly goes ups and downs. And it's really hard for myself to focus on content creation and things like that if I'm going through something like this. And a lot of that can be stirred up from my 2020 experience of just being really depressed throughout. At the beginning of 2020, it started out great. I was able to find my new girlfriend after her breaking up with a harsh one that made me really just end up start having problems. Alongside that, I also ended up having issues with much, much more during 2020 with depression and anxiety. All those just kept going up and down due to work, due to school. My last year at senior high school was hell for me. I was having very, very, very bad problems. And then 2021 hit and it just never got improved. It just constantly got worse and worse and worse. And I was never able to really improve. 2021 had bad problems, such as my current girlfriend breaking up with me a couple times. But things were starting to look on the up and up during June when I was finally moved out of my old house, which was a huge improvement. As you can tell, the setup is completely different and this is at a new home. And I'm very, very happy here to be out of that house. It keeps me creatively going. And my girlfriend keeps me going every day, waking up feeling better and better. And as well, I've also gotten much happier. I'm about to move into my place for college. And I'm just going to be doing way more videos as I want to. However, that can't be said for everything. Because I did have a problem with suicide during 2020 and 2021. To the point of early this year, during March, April, and May. There was multiple times where I debated my own suicide multiple times. I was going through so much in my life that I just didn't feel like I could handle it. And I debated suicide, and that is not in a joking manner. That wasn't me going for detention. I was silent about it. I never told anyone about these things. This was my own problem. But like I say, I've improved so much as this year has gone on, and I have become so much happier as a person. I feel the best I've ever felt, and I'm excited to start my college, and I'm excited to continue creating content for y'all. And I'm excited to continue creating content for y'all, and that's something that I definitely need to hit on. I think my biggest problem with YouTube was that I never saw it as for fun or for my personal wants. I always saw it as a job, that I was going to make this my job, even though... I was having problems with that and it kept driving me and driving me to the point where I would just fail and stop doing it. And this would constantly happen and I was having a problem with that. Because the thing is, I love YouTube. I love the creation process of YouTube, going through and editing, filming, scripting even. Even though I'm not a big fan of it, I still like doing it. I like all of those and somehow I was having problems with everything. So I'm going to change. I want to strive to make what I love instead. So yes. I am killing off KC Interactive. The original intention of KC Interactive was to create something that was for multiple people to come on and kind of create content with me and we could have this almost org-like area for it, but it, that ended up not following through. So now I want to create something that is just about me, this one person, and I want to make it thrive around my channel and my ideas. And so I'm going to be rebranding the channel instead of KC Interactive to just KC. And what I'm going to be doing on here is I want to do what I've been learning to love, which is this guy i've been learning to love making keyboards and i want to continue creating them and i've also noticed that i've loved creating setup content and i want to continue doing so as well and because of that i'm also going to be rebranding this the discord because the discord had been a very unwelcoming place for a very long time it was kind of just a place for me and my friends to hang and i never really invited people in and helped them and so i want to be rebranding the kc discord if you join the discord right now you can actually dm me and i can start doing ideas i just put out that post very recently and as well i will be rebranding casey streams instead of having the casey interactive twitch channel i'll be rebranding it as casey streams where i'll be creating keyboards there playing games doing stuff like that and to make things more comfortable and just overall to do things that make me happier and that's definitely one of the things i recommend 
My final message for this video is A, do something that makes you happy. I don't think anyone should be creating or doing things that they don't enjoy, and that includes streaming or doing anything such as that. B, no, I will not be killing off KC Interactive technically, but a lot of the series that were here are not going to be around as much. But the KC reviews will be coming back around as a keyboard reviews channel, and as well, I will also be having KC setup slash KC tech be continued. My last message completely is to have endurance, to constantly work hard and make sure you're doing okay, and B, if you're not doing okay, if you're suffering with depress depression, anxiety, anything of that sort, reach out to someone. I will have my email down in the description. If you need to reach out for someone, please contact me, talk to me, and I can help get you some help, or if not, I can help you myself. But other than that, guys, I want you guys to take care of each other and do everything you can for each other. Other than that, see you all next time. Love you all.